first started playing Sessions, I had one good amp and one good speaker cabinet and an SM57. And I would take this rig around town to different studios and I was always kind of checking out like, okay, what preamps are they using? And the first time I plugged into an API, I went, that's what I want my guitar to sound like. And this pedal has that sound. I love using an EQ as a boost. I can never get enough mid-range for some reason, and this thing just has it in spades. I mean, you just crank it up, and even at extreme EQ settings, it just, it always sounds good. It's just kind of like, yeah, more of that, great. I usually don't use a compressor because it changes the way the guitar feels, but this thing just feels great to play through. It just smooths everything out, and. Again, I keep coming back to like that jump out of the speakers thing. Today we sent the quarter inch signal into the amp and then the XLR signal right into the audio interface. And what that allows you to do is capture the amp sound and the dry sound. And that's something I always do at home for clients too. Uh, it gives them the ability to change the sound later through reamping or virtual amps. I was working on a project that had a lot of lap steel on it. It was right around the time I started trying out this pedal. I need all the help I can get on the lap steel, and this pedal really came through with flying colors. I cranked up the compression and cranked up the high end, and it just really makes that thing just sing. A lot of times when you plug in a new pedal, you can kind of hear it changing the tone in a bad way, even you know when the pedal's off. But with this, it just sounded like my guitar uh, only better and it didn't add any noise, which is pretty remarkable.